So what are the misconceptions and myths about erectile dysfunction? So where do I start? There's so many myths about erectile dysfunction. For one, people think that erectile dysfunction affect only men they are older. But we do know that in real life, that erectile dysfunction can occur in young teenage boys all the way to men in the 80s. Number two, we think that erectile dysfunction only occur in those that have medical comorbidities like hypertension, cholesterol, diabetes, heart disease. But we know very well that ED can affect young male who are rigor and who are basically look after their body really well from that point of view. Now we also know that from an erectile dysfunction point of view, it can affect not just their bedroom activities because we do know that erectile dysfunction can affect work productivity due to increase in mental distress and also decrease in concentration. Some of the myths about erectile dysfunction center around the use of herbal supplement. So we know that herbal supplements sometimes can work, but most of the time it works on patients that have a very pure psychogenic erectile dysfunction, which is the minority of patients in this group. So many of the time, patients spend a lot of money using drugs that are not effective. And worse, many of these patients fall into the um, false marketing uh, by company that are considered unethical by selling drugs that is not effective and also drugs that is not approved for erectile dysfunction. We know that men's health uh, cover both in terms of sexual function and also reproductive and urinary dysfunction as well. Men's usually are very shy to see the GP. We need to increase awareness about men's health issue. We need to raise education about the need to see GP and specialists to address some of the men's health issue. And importantly, we also need to see more government funding into the research for men's health. Okay. As we know before, Spontane is a nasal technology system that delivers oral uh, PDE5 drug. So in comparison between the nasal Spontane versus oral PDE5, Spontane has shown faster clinical action, it has shown good tolerability, and importantly, it also has allowed for more spontaneity because patients do not need to take an oral drug before sex so they can have a nasal delivery of the PDE5 by themselves. So I think Spontan certainly has a very important role and I think that Spontan can transform the landscape of ED treatment. Mm -hmm.